Brandon, if I'm William Cook, we are checking out City Lights, a band I've never heard of. Got a song called Where You've Been from 2011. Matt recommended this band to me. He said, if you like pop punk, easy core, uh, then you should check out the band City Lights from the early 2010s. Recommended this song in particular, and I believe this band's kind of faded away since uh, since this time. You know, they're not around right now. I've never heard of them, but I trust Matt has some good taste if he's coming by my channel. I'm excited to check this one out. So City Lights, where you've been, what you got? What do you say, pop, punk, easy core? Turn it up! Yeah, I like pop punk and easy core. Uh oh. This is very easy core. Two vocalists. Yeah, this feels very, uh, 2010, 2011, you know, mid to late 2000s. I like the kind of second half to the chorus here where kind of half time it. No, a good hook. It's not about where you've been, it's about where you want to be. I believe that's what they're saying and I like that. You can tell they're very underground. It's still very low budget and these guys never really did take off. That you got those a day to remember feels chunk no captain chunk. I'm just not really seeing that star quality, I guess. I love the gray hook, gray hook. So we got the big and then boom, boom. Kind of halftime it, huh? Opens it up real big, big. And then fast again, here we go. And then real pump. Pretty typical, pretty typical. And a good, uh, good formula, man, an effective formula. In Vogue Records, I mean, they had In Vogue, so that's a decently big deal right there. Solid track, man. Solid track as, as hell, right? Definitely not much to, uh, to complain about with that one. A good chorus and an uplifting kind of chorus, too. The uh, kind of encouraging type of song. Me, as a guy who doesn't dive into lyrics, it's the type of song that you hear and just tells you straight up. Not, It's not about where you've been, it's about where you want to be in. Don't have to dive too far into that to kind of just hear that hear that message right off the bat. It had its catch to it. I liked you got the, the the lead vocalist, but the guitarist there had some 
backing vocals. I just felt like it was a little bit unsure of itself in a way. The video, it just kind of felt a bit amateur from the video to the pretty standard formula of the song. It just doesn't really surprise me to see like, oh yeah, that band kind of fell apart after this, you know? They never quite made it. But there's plenty of great bands out there that never really made it that put out some great music. And Matt, I appreciate you for recommending me this song that I would have never otherwise heard if you did not uh, let me know about it. You know, I could see that one being a, a good song for the gym playlist, you know, just something there to good pick me up kind of song. Not the type of song that's like, well, I've got to dive into City Lights and hear everything from them now. But, you know, Matt, if you told me that, yeah, dude, you should check out the full album or whatever. I'd, I'd take your uh, I'd take your advice. I trust your opinion. So thank you, Matt, and thank you, City Lights, and thank you for checking this out. Love a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. Hit the subscribe for more alternative content, and leave your thoughts in the comments below. Let me know what you thought of uh, City Lights. Love to chat. I'll see you next time.